changes. In 1776, this great nation accepted that armed conflict was the only way to preserve our rights to life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. If our founding fathers could only see us now. From Antietam to Amiens, Okinawa to Anchorage, we have fought. And now, the red menace is at our doorstep. Democracy itself is under threat of annihilation. July 4th, 2076, 300 years after our great nation began, we gather together to honor the completion of Vault 76. This sprawling underground shelter may have been engineered by Vault Tech, but it was built by you, the good people of America, so that if the bombs do come, if the end does come, our way of life will endure. But not everyone will be saved. Those must be our best and our brightest. For when the fight and the fallout has settled, you must rebuild. Not just walls, not just buildings, but hearts and minds, and ultimately, America itself. So as we stand here today, we pray that the world will know peace. But if that is not our destiny, if war must come, we stand together knowing that here in Vault 76, our future begins. forget the day you all entered Vault 76. You come from every walk of life, every race, color, and creed. But you all share one very important trait. You are this country's best and brightest. But more importantly, you'll always be my family.
Attention citizens, nuclear strike imminent. Please exit the area at your earliest convenience. Thank you for your cooperation. You have been tasked with nothing less than the rebuilding of America. Such a huge responsibility. Just know that vault -Tech is proud of you. I am proud of you. When you hear this, it means I've been gone for several hours. I've got my own mission out there in Appalachia. This is the Overseer, signing off. message repeats in 24 hours. System breakdown. Hello. At last. Today is your reclamation day. I bet you're just bursting your bolts to get out there and see the world. Nothing at all. The exterior sensors were taken out of commission after that unfortunate business with the nuclear bombs. With so many of your friends having been gone so long, I cannot begin to speculate how they've transformed Appalachia already. No, and we're not likely to get one. It's been months. Besides, she left this place behind to reclaim America. It's past time you followed her example. It is endearing to hear how wonderful a job myself and the others have done maintaining the vault for these many months. But the food's all run out and it's time to take what you've learned and use it. The kiosks have valuable information to help you thrive out there. Best get cracking! Reclamation Day. How exciting! raw meat? Bad. Eating irradiated raw meat? So, 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 so bad. Hunger and thirst can increase your disease risk. You do not want to contract weeping sores. Believe you me. Another day, another opportunity to leave Vault 76. What do you say? That's right, sir. Free samples. Yum, yum.
this day is stocked with medicines. I know it's cozy in here, but you'll soon be faced with a distinct lack of power and shelter. Outside, with a little elbow grease, you'll be powering up West Virginia in no time. Oh, come on. Building a personal power grid and making your own electricity, how hard could it be? So, will Sir be leaving the vault today, or sleeping in for another few months? Teamwork. It's what built America. It's what built me. When you get outside, do remember your manners. Be nice. Be helpful. Be vault -tech. When you get outside, find each other. Seek strength in numbers. Utilize both your similarities and differences. Overseer's log, or should I say, direct communication. Because whoever is listening to this had the moxie to try to find out where I've gone. But I'm glad you did. Truth is, I need your help. I've been given a task and I've decided to break protocol and tell you what it is. Because if there's one thing I've learned in these past few years, it's that we need to rely on each other. There were three active nuclear silos in Appalachia before the bombs fell. They blew up the world before. We can't let it happen again. So we've got to locate and secure all of the silos. Or die trying. Hopefully the former. But it's been 25 years. I just don't know what we're gonna find out there. Or where to start. My directive was to go to the nearest population center and assess the situation. I'll set up a camp on the way once I get my bearings. Find me there. Building America. How utterly terrifying. Glad I'm staying here. <laughs> Still, I'm sure your camp will make it easy peasy. Need a cooking station? Use your camp. A new house? Your camp. Some small luxuries? Your camp. A battleship. as your mobile home away from home. Well, you know, just your home, period.
Is today the day? Leaving the vault at last? The overseer could be anywhere by now. Please, sir, I can't pretend it's reclamation day any longer. Even my programming has limits. Never stop learning. Be the best that you can be. Remember one of Voltec's many, many mottos. Hard work is happy work. Some may call them jobs, but I like to think of them as perks. I know it will be scary out there, but you possess the skills to not only survive, but thrive. Remember, adaptability is key. If your role isn't working, try another. Get creative. Possess the skills necessary to accomplish anything. I'm sure of it. Arrivederci! Au revoir! Au revoir! Au revoir! Bye, Acondios!